Week one Sunday is in the books, and there were some tremendous performances from guys we may have not expected. But will they continue? Will week two bring you the same value? Will Gardner Minshew throw for three touchdowns every week? Will Naheem Hines catch eight balls and run for two touchdowns every week? Now, Hines is interesting. Remember, Phil Rivers liked a guy named Danny Woodhead in San Diego, and he locked on him all year long. So I feel like Hines has the same ability to be that guy. Russell Gage in Atlanta. Will he continue his prowess? Matt Ryan threw the ball 50 plus times and that will continue in the fantasy world of Atlanta. Anthony Miller, if you listen to last week's segment, he played a heck of a role for the Chicago Bears. 476 and one with a tremendous catch at the end by Mitch. Will that continue as a number two receiver? Keelan Cole in Jacksonville, 547 and one. He is DJ Chark's right hand man. When DJ gets double coverage, Keelan Cole will be open and then we have logan thomas ron rivera always had a solid tight end in carolina by the name of greg olson and logan thomas was the guy who dwayne haskin looked to for safety and he looked to as an outlet and he consistently looked to him throughout the game this will continue in week two and beyond these are the diamonds of the rough of week one will they continue in week two you'll have to stay tuned for next monday's edition of the fantasy facts